September 15th, 1916. It's a chilly Friday morning in northern France, and the Battle of Fleurs Corselet has begun. A new British secret weapon is making its debut, the Mark I heavy tank. It's a 28-ton beast designed to provide infantry support. Lieutenant Harold Morty Mortimer, commander of the tank D-1 Daredevil, leads the attack. 48 tanks were assigned to the attack, but many of them didn't even make it to the starting line. Roughly 36 were used on the morning of the 15th, with mixed results. During the battle, 12 of these tanks broke down, 10 were knocked out, and 12 survived. The tanks themselves played a very small part in the overall battle, but ultimately, the British were successful. However, due to their poor performance, the tank was not seen as a success. But with continued development, the tank would eventually become the catalyst, which would change the nature of warfare and the way it was fought.